um, soul work is slow work. Soul like work is slow like work. Like you've mentioned, is slow. Yeah. How can we stay encouraged in the long run? And should, and if yes, then how should we measure in fa- effectiveness and success in this regrowth? Yes. Well, we stay encouraged partly by a strong doctrine of sin. That uh, although we're in the kingdom of the Son, um, we're not in the kingdom without sin. And uh, we expect people to regress. We accept, expect temptation. We find it ourselves. We're attracted by wealth, by nice homes, by nice cars. We do, wrong, we do things for the wrong motives. So just, just expect it. And, and, and along the way, uh, we're picking up the pieces in our own life and in others' lives from just some bad, unwise decisions or sinful decisions. And not to be surprised by that. So we have a healthy doctrine of, of sin. Um, and the other side of it, of course, is a healthy doctrine of sanctification that uh, the Spirit sets apart and purifies. The fruits of the Spirit will happen. The John 15 fruit will happen of love and of making disciples. Um, And we don't know how long it's going to take. I want people to be patient with me, and so let's be patient with them. Um, It gets hard, though, when the budget's a bit low and the money's not coming in and there's expectations of of growth. So don't... Yeah, it comes out of doctrine in the end. So if you, if you set up a vision of massive growth and so on, then you're setting yourself up for a fall. We don't know exactly what's going to happen in terms of numbers and growth and new buildings and all the rest of it. Um, we'll come back to that later on. But, yeah, I think doctrine of sin, doctrine of sanctification, put them together, whichever one you need most today. <laughs> 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 right.